Hello, this is Greg Brzezinski for Beard Brand Alliance. It's Halloween, tis the season. Tis the season. So people who saw my last video um, about hair through the ages or the history of long hair, uh, a couple of people commented that it was just an excuse to do cosplay. Probably came off that way to some people. I did solicit the help of my friend Dave, who is a cosplayer and a guy who frequents the Renaissance Fair as well as uh, beard competitions in costume. And he had a trunk load of stuff, um, which aided me in doing those different looks. Um, this time, since uh, we are headed for Halloween as well as Christmas, wanted to take an opportunity to um, um, just follow up on a video that I had done previously in which I talked about setting goals for your hair and the beard. In my case, it was establishing the fact that I was preparing for Halloween and Christmas to be this guy. Now that's Kurt Russell. Uh, he was uh, Santa Claus in the Santa Chronicles, a great movie. Take a look at it. Uh, it's pretty funny. I think it will become, a um, after a slow start, I think it will become a, a Christmas classic. Uh, people routinely tell me that I look like Kurt Russell. Um, you can see in this picture that uh, there is somewhat of a resemblance. Um, he's a little older than I am, but there is some facial um, uh, features that are similar, but also just the hair and the beard at this time uh, makes us look uh, much more alike. So what I'm gonna do is take my uh, beard and hair and uh, do a little prep on that. I was prepared to actually add um, extensions to my beard in the form of a beard fall. Um, which is basically um, a weave and prepared to put it under and comb my hair into it. But you can see there's not a color match. And so before I do this, I'm gonna get this the right color. So I've decided actually to leave my beard natural. It's quite not quite as long as Kurt Russell's was. In the movie. Um, but uh, we're going to give it a go. What I'm going to do, and which I've already done a little bit, is I'm taking um, this basically watercolor tempera paint. You can also use a spray paint if you wanted to transform your beard to a white color. People ask me all the time when I've done videos before. And you can check back here. I've actually done a video where I lightened my beard. Um, I'm taking a little sea salt spray just as a medium in that um, white tempera paint. This is the uh, cheapo ghetto version, just making a little thing. And putting that in mostly my beard uh, mustache and my uh, handlebars, which tend to be darker anyhow, to lighten them up a little bit. Kurt Russell's beard in that movie was um, mostly uh, salt with a little bit of pepper. And I think this is probably enough to mimic that. He has definitive stylized curls in his beard. And what I'm going to do is with the aid of a curling iron, which I talked about before. I can't believe I'm doing this twice in one month. So I'm using this big barreled uh, curling iron. You could also use a round brush and a hair dryer just to make this a little tighter looking. His has a definitive rolled under look in the photograph. But I want to roll it up under too much because that would shorten the look. I want to make it uh, pretty long, but generally make it um, look like it has a definitive shape like a true uh, Santa Claus. So I'm taking this very small curling iron, pick this up, it was $15. To add more stylized curls to my beard. Curling iron shut off, they have automatic shut offs. Anyhow, give it a minute. So I'm now using a small barreled uh, curling iron. Um, this would be hard to do with a round brush just because you can't roll it in and get it tight enough. Um, you can see in this image, uh, Kurt Russell has definitively uh, stylized curls. Um, so what I'm going to do is actually um, add just some curls on the top layer of my beard by using this small barrel, it's half inch um, barreled curling iron. It was, I think, $15 at the um, Barbering Beauty Supply Store.
Once again, you're not doing this every day. So like the, um, are you burning your hair? Um, that I'm not keeping it on long and I'm not doing this every day. I think if your hair is conditioned, my beard was conditioned prior. And if you have a layer of conditioning on your hair, it actually will protect it from any damage from heat. But once again, be careful um, that uh, you're not uh, frying your hair. Um, I think it would take a lot to actually do that. Beard hair is pretty resilient. Uh, and much coarser than the head on your hair. And so um, I don't think uh, we'll have that danger. So they're added stylized curls. I'll come back and I'm doing the other side and then we'll see what the finished beard looks like. So there we go. That's uh, what I'm going to do to my beard. Uh, my mustache is pretty natural right now with the curls. Um, Kurt Russell has a handlebar uh, rocking a little bit in here. I'm actually just going to take a little bit of styling balm and um, like put a little bit on this. Put the rest on my eyebrows. So to finish this look, we have a hairspray, and that's the beard. So Kurt Russell has a layered haircut. Uh, mine's probably a little longer than his, um, but we have uh, pretty much the same kind of look. So we have Greg Brzezinski, it's Kurt Russell, and Santa Chronicles. But this look wouldn't be complete without. Ta-da! So there we go. It's uh, Greg Brzezinski as Kurt Russell in the Santa Chronicles. Um, I think the beard looks okay uh, without the fall. So I think we're gonna go with this. So as I said, this was a test. We'll make some tweaks uh, to the hair color, I think, and we'll finish up the costume with the hat and the gloves and the whole bit. Um, comment below and tell us what you'll be doing uh, this Halloween season. And uh, having a beard has an impact on what you can, cannot do with a Halloween costume. Uh, so tell us below what your favorite bearded Halloween costumes are. Till we meet again. Dude, you want simplicity. Grab the styling balm. It's designed for your hair and your beard. It will give a satin finish with a medium hold. No, it's not a conditioning product. It's a styling product. Styling balm over at beardbrand.com.